just contacted United for some questions to double check on the luggage and carry on and all that requirements or allowance as they call it. First, I called their customer service line. It was an automated system. And he said that the automated man said they can text me so I could just text chat with a representative. So I was like, oh, yeah. And so I answered with, yes. So then I did communicate with, I don't know, either a bot, which might have turned into a human. It's hard to tell. It might have been. And this is my experience. It was so funny. So look, after I accidentally gave, <laughs> they ask for, I don't want to give you my details, my personal information. So it does this. And I clicked on Android, but it also says to type hi. And I was so busy rushing around, I typed hi. And I clicked on the Android because I have an Android phone. I have a Galaxy. And then I realized I only needed to do one. So I just continued on here. And mm. hi. <laughs> and I'm like, I picked a allowance. Because originally I picked like, I don't know, all different things. What did I do? A... And then I did A and B. And then I realized E because I had like a question about a third piece of luggage, so to speak. I wanted to know about carry on bags, check bags, and then like a purse or something else that you would bring on the plane. I got so confused. The, the machine had a lot of confusion. And then they want to know are you traveling domestic or international? domestic because we're going to Orlando and then they said we'll message you when an agent is available and I'm like all right cool <laughs> so, please provide your confirmation or reference number full name in a sentence summarizing your the assistance you need we'll need that in order to process in order to proceed as it allows your agent to help you better and faster so I gave my name my full name I would like to know the baggage allowance for carry-on checked bags and purses for domestic flight, flight, please. And then they said, well, we appreciate your patience, blah, blah, blah. And I gave the confirmation number to my universal confirmation by my universal thing by accident. Because that was the first email that I pulled up with the confirmation number. And then I realized that was the wrong one. So I said, I'm not going to show it to you because it's confidential. But then I said, sorry, that was the wrong one. Let me go grab the other one. And I did. And then I sent my flight confirmation number. And then I've got somebody named Lyria. I think her name was. I don't know. And then they responded with upon checking. Here is here. Checking here. Your ticket is standard economy. But we're economy premier. So I wasn't sure if there was a difference in luggage requirements or allowance. So this is what they said for carry on, blah, blah, blah. And then, cause Daniel plans on bringing something too. And then I asked, is there a size limit for check on luggage or is there only a weight limit? Because when I looked online, there was like a, a measurement, you know, size requirements or allowance. And they responded with, upon checking in my resources for checked baggage, the standard size limit is 62 linear inches. 158 centimeters length equals length equals height. And the standard weight is 50 pounds or 23 kilograms. Thank you very much. You're welcome. <laughs> You're very welcome. Since you are flying with United, blah, blah, blah. All right. So I went to Daniel and I said, this is where it gets funny. So I told him. I'm text chatting with the rep about the allowance for our bags and luggage. And he said, okay, he's good. And then I said, we do follow economy, but the luggage itself, she's saying goes by weight. I asked about size just now. Does size matter? Oh, behave. <laughs> Does size matter? I don't know. And then that's when she came back with the length equals weight, width equals height thing. And then I sent him that, which she said... Well, what she said originally, and then what, he, what she said originally about this. 
So he has it too. And then I said, waiting for answer to my question. And then I, and then I said, wait, and then I sent him what she said about the length width height thing. And I answered him with, so now I have to be a math whiz. <laughs> and then he said, okay, sounds good. Cause Daniel's not bad at, um, that. And then I said, she's trying to sell me the Chase credit card. I asked about AR, APR, LOL. And he goes, geez, cause like, we're not really keen on stuff that requires an annual fee. Like there's just no point. And I sent him that in case he wants to look into it. An annual, fee. and he says an annual fees. And then I said the blue one, and it's ninety five dollars a year. I used to have it, and it was pointless for me since I'm not a frequent flyer. And he said, "Don't cut it." And I said, "Ha, ah, okay." I said, "No, thank you." And then she said this, and then I said, <laughs> "You're welcome, and thanks so much for your help." <laughs> that was an that was an honest mistype. And then I said, "Help." Asterisk. And then I said, honest mistype. And he said, LOL. <laughs> and I sent these gifts of Jonah. <laughs> I, I never even watched that show before. I'm like, a character from some television show, Superstore, that Daniel told me is a parody of Walmart. So this is the other funny part. Before you go, we're always looking. So she wanted me to do a survey. How satisfied were you with today's overall messaging experience? And I picked B. And I told Daniel, I picked B because now I have to do area. <laughs> and then the rest of the survey, I like gave her like the top answer. But I'm like, <laughs> that's why I picked B because now I have to do area. Like she couldn't tell me 12 by 7 times 24 is the maximum size for your, your, your suitcase or duffel bag, or whatever you're using to check in for luggage. I, I gave them the B because they couldn't just tell you the the dimensions. Like, why can't you just tell me the dimensions? Why are you giving me the total size? Length equals width equals height, which it should be length times width times height equals this number. But yeah, that was, I just wanted to share that funny experience with you about asking united what the requirements or allowance are for our luggage and things for our trip that was just so funny <laughs> and um this also shows you another side of me that maybe you didn't see yet uh, yeah i'll leave you with that i'll leave you with that and i'll leave you with jonah how about no <laughs> no <laughs> thank you for your help help yeah, he's a little blurry there. But it's so funny. It was an honest mistype. <laughs> oh my god, it's so funny. So funny.